Hey there, Cowboys fan, let's talk about what's really on everyone's mind Mike McCarthy. You've been watching, I've been watching, and let's face it, this season has been rough. Sitting at 3-7, with no home wins in 2024, it feels like things are spiraling. You've probably heard this stat, the Cowboys are the only American men's pro sports team without a home win this year. That's not just frustrating, it's embarrassing for a franchise with our history. Now, we can't ignore the facts. McCarthy's contract is running out, and even if he makes it to the end of the season, is there really a future with him leading this team? The decisions on the field, the lack of adjustments, the losing streak, it's clear the team isn't clicking under his leadership. Let me ask you, do you think McCarthy should go? Drop your answer in the comments because, honestly, this debate is heating up among Cowboys Nation. Should Jerry Jones pull the plug now, or wait it out until the season's over? And while you're at it, imagine this, a fresh start, a new head coach bringing energy, strategy, and leadership that gets us back on track. The question is, who's the right fit? Is there a savior out there who can handle the pressure of Dallas and take us to the next level? Think about it for a second, we're not just talking about changing a coach. We're talking about changing the entire trajectory of this team. The stakes couldn't be higher and Jerry Jones knows it. Speaking of Jerry, he might already be dropping hints about who could step in. Stick around there's someone he's been praising lately and it might just give us a clue about the Cowboys future. Alright, so let's talk about Jerry Jones. Love him or hate him, you've got to admit when he speaks, people listen. And on his recent radio interview with 105.3 The Fan, he dropped some interesting comments. You know Jerry, he's never one to shy away from stirring the pot, and this time he's talking about none other than Cliff Kingsbury. Now, you probably remember Kingsbury, he's the former Arizona Cardinals head coach who had a roller coaster tenure there. Sure, his record wasn't the best to 8371, but let's not forget, he's been busy since then. After leaving the NFL, he went to USC to work with Caleb Williams, who's shaping up to be the first overall pick in the 2020 for draft. That's not exactly a bad rebound, right? Here's what makes this interesting, Kingsbury is a Texas native. Born in San Antonio, he started his coaching journey here, and you know how much Texans love their own. Could this be the kind of homecoming story that inspires a turnaround for the Cowboys? But let's not get ahead of ourselves. What do you think about Kingsbury? Is he the right guy for the job, or are we just chasing another flashy name? Take a moment to vote in the comments thumbs up for Kingsbury, or thumbs down if you think we need to look elsewhere. And here's the kicker, Jerry's praise wasn't random. The Cowboys face Kingsbury's current team, the Commanders, this week. That means we'll get a first-hand look at what he's been working on. So here's my challenge to you. Watch the game closely and decide for yourself if he's head coach material. Still, Kingsbury isn't the only name in the mix. Up next, we'll dive into another big contender coach who's turning heads across the league. Stay tuned, let's shift gears and talk about another name that's been making waves, Ben Johnson. If you haven't heard of him yet, let me fill you in. Johnson is the offensive coordinator for the Detroit Lions, and let me tell you, this guy has been turning heads across the league. The Lions offense this season, explosive, creative, dynamic, basically everything we've been wishing to see from the Cowboys. Johnson has built a system that maximizes talent, and his ability to adapt and innovate has made him one of the most sought-after coaching candidates in the NFL. In fact, fans and media alike have been buzzing about him on social media. But here's the catch. So far, there's been no word that the Cowboys are seriously considering him. Why not? That's the million-dollar question. Could it be that Jerry Jones has his eyes set on someone else? Or is this just a classic Cowboys move waiting until the last minute? Now, think about it. Imagine Johnson bringing that same energy to Dallas. 
a young, innovative coach who could finally unlock this team's potential and get us back to being America's team in more than just name, doesn't that sound like exactly what we need right now? But I want to hear from you. If it came down to Ben Johnson or Cliff Kingsbury, who gets your vote? Drop your choice in the comments below and let's see who Cowboys Nation is backing. And here's another question. Do you think Johnson's style would fit with the Cowboys roster as it stands, or would we need to see some big changes to make it work? Let me know your thoughts this is your team too. After all, next, we're diving into something a little closer to home. Kingsbury has a Texas connection that might make him the sentimental favorite. But is sentiment enough to win in the NFL? Let's talk about it. Alright, let's circle back to Cliff Kingsbury, because there's one thing about him that might tip the scales in his favor, his Texas roots. Look, we Texans take pride in our own, and Kingsbury is as Texas as it gets. Born in San Antonio, he started his coaching career here, and you know what they say there's no place like home, Kingsbury's story is full of Lone Star connections, from playing college ball at Texas Tech to coaching at Houston and later at Texas A&M, this guy knows what football means in this state. And for a franchise like the Cowboys, where tradition and identity mean everything, that kind of connection matters. But let's get real for a second, does being a Texas guy really make someone the best fit for this job? Sure, it's a nice narrative, but nice stories don't win championships, at the end of the day. We need someone who can bring results, not just sentimental value. So here's where I turn it over to you. Does Kingsbury's Texas background give him an edge, or is it just a feel-good factor? Vote in the comments yes or no, and while we're at it, let's imagine Kingsbury coming back to Texas to coach the Cowboys. Would that be enough to reignite this team, or do we need someone with a completely fresh perspective like Ben Johnson? That's the debate, and I want to hear where you stand. Here's the thing. A coach with local ties might be more motivated to succeed, especially under the spotlight of the Cowboys. But does that outweigh the need for innovation and fresh ideas? That's the million-dollar question we'll need to answer. Now, let's look at the bigger picture. Whoever takes this job isn't just stepping into a coaching role, they're inheriting all the challenges and expectations that come with leading America's team. Let's break that down next. So here we are at the heart of the matter, the future of the Dallas Cowboys. Whether it's Cliff Kingsbury, Ben Johnson, or someone else entirely, whoever takes over this team is walking into a pressure cooker. Let's be real, being the head coach of America's team isn't just a job, it's a legacy. This isn't just about winning games, it's about restoring pride. After all, the Cowboys aren't just any franchise. With a storied history and a fan base that spans the globe, the expectations are sky high. And let's not sugarcoat it, the next coach will inherit a team that's been struggling. From a lack of home wins to a quarterback situation that's up in the air, the challenges are immense. But here's the thing, Cowboys fans like you deserve more. You deserve a team that not only competes but dominates, and the right coach can make that happen. The question is, who has the vision, the strategy, and the guts to step into this role and thrive under the bright lights of a TNT stadium? So let's put it out there, what's your dream scenario for? The Cowboys, is it Kingsbury making a triumphant return to Texas? Is it Ben Johnson bringing his innovative offense to Dallas? Or is it someone we haven't even talked about yet? Share your thoughts in the comments because this decision isn't just Jerry Jones, it's about what Cowboys Nation wants. And while you're thinking about it, hit that subscribe button. Trust me, you won't want to miss the updates as this coaching drama unfolds. Who knows, maybe the next time we're talking will be celebrating the arrival of a new head coach who can finally take this team to the promised land. Until then, keep the faith, Cowboys fan. The future might be uncertain, but one thing's for sure, the Dallas Cowboys are bigger than any one season, coach or player. It's time to rise again.